When you create a form based on a table in Access, any features that were in the table are brought over to the form. In this table, there was a combo box for category. And when it was brought over to the form, a combo box came over. Now, if we're going to add a new record, that is there for us to select the category. It would be nice to have a combo box here for school. I'm going to create a combo box that when we enter a new record, I can quickly select school. I'm going to go into design view. And here on that particular field, I'm going to right click and say change to combo box. I'm going to right click again and I'm going to go to properties. And here in properties, the row source type, click there, I would like it to be a value list. Now the row source, where is the information going to come from? We click there. And it says type each item on a separate line. Now I have already typed those items. They're in Word. Let me get them quickly. Here they are. I'm going to select them. I'm going to copy them. And I'm going to put them here into this. Here they are. And I'm going to say OK. There they all are in the row source. And I'm going to close that now. And I'm going to go back into Form View. And I'm going to go to New Record. And there the schools are. The, that combo box came from when the table was created. This combo box has come from when the entry form was designed by me now. I went to, let me just check this again, design view. I went, clicked on here, and I went to, and I changed it to, I changed it to combo box, and then I went there, and I went to properties, and I said row source, and I selected at the side value list, and then I added all this information in there quickly by that little box. This is so nice. It makes life so much easier when you enter information to have this combo box.